Hello, welcome to Inner Peace Sunday, your Inner Peace on weekend. Thank you very much for joining us today. So, how are you everyone? If you are doing well, please give us some signal by telling us your roll call, your name, local time, and the place where you watch this broadcasting from, so that way I can get to know you, and we can get to know in each other in this small community. And so, this Inner Peace Sunday is welcome everyone who are interested to practice meditation together online. So it doesn't matter where you live, if you like to meditate together as a community, here is where you can also spend your time on, on your weekend. And so I'm sure it is some place somewhere in, your, in this world, maybe in your country, is in the morning, here right now is in, at night. But nevertheless, let, let, let's not that make as a boundary, uh, as, a, as a way to prevent us from practice meditation together. And so everyone, well, <coughs> how are you? Have you been practiced regularly? Let me check who has joining us now. Right, right now I'm on time. So let's see, Mr. Mr. Tommy, it's been a while I haven't seen you last week. Miss Diane, hope you're doing well. And Miss Rita, good to see you as well. But hopefully your cough is getting better. In fact, I just got my uh, throat. Uh, uh, I just just got a shot, three shot on three days consecutively. So that way, uh, my I have a better throat now. Now, hopefully it doesn't act up during when I'm meditating with you today. Now, as for before we begin, we still have a little bit of our time before we are doing actual meditation. So please allow me a few minutes of our time to introduce how do we practice meditation. But if you feel you don't want to do with your own meditation, don't worry. You can also do your way as well. You can also do mine or you do yours. It doesn't matter. So if you feel you want to follow the way I taught you, I teach you, no problem. If you feel that you want to do your own meditations, I mean, the way you practice regularly, no problem too, so you are welcome. Now, what I'm about to produce, uh, introduce to you is called the Middle Way Meditation. The Middle Way Meditation practiced by follow, uh, <coughs> by focusing the mind inside our body at the place called center of the body. Okay, just one moment. <coughs> hmm. Where is it? Ah, here. The center of the body, as you may see on the diagram, it is located inside ourselves or our, our abdomen. And it is just right about two finger width above your navel. When you are doing so, you can also find your center through your feeling. You feeling them, of course. Don't try to use your eyes because when you meditate, of course, we are closing our eyes, but some place they may uh, uh, open their eyes, but when you meditate here, if you like to, you can. I would like to in, uh, invite everyone to close your eyes, okay? When you close your eyes here, you use your feeling, kind of like when you uh, try to find your center by using your feeling, like if you're asking, for example, are you hungry? If you feel your stomach, whether it's empty or not, that is how you use your feeling. So if you feel your stomach, that is where you're going to focus. And so we focus our mind by using something simple, something that doesn't make us thinking, something that quite easy for us to visualize and doesn't create our emotion or thought. For example, like the sun in here, like you see in the diagram. At the same time, if you feel like you want to use something other object besides what I show in here, it is also no problem. For example, whether it's the sun, the moon, a star, or the crystal ball, it is doesn't matter. As long as you are comfortable to use, you are good to go. Therefore, if you are really want to use this method, choose just one object. Don't try to use like one minute the moon, next minute the sun. Keep switching them around, it won't help you steal your mind is only create the thoughts in your mind. So that's choose only just one. However, 
sometimes when you are visualized, it may not be enough to stop you from thinking. So when it's not enough to stop you from thinking, maybe you might want to consider the other method. And the middle way meditation offers the second method, which is called mantra. The mantra I am about to introduce to you is the tradition that practice in my temple. I just follow from my master. However, you can feel, you can try to use this. Let's say this together, everyone. Samma Arahang Samma Arahang Samma Arahang Like this. But repeat them in your mind though. But you may be wondering what does it mean? Samma Arahang is an old language in India. It is written in Thai accent, style, in fact. Samma means purity. Arahang means freedom from the negative thought. So combine these two terms, they mean the path to purity and freedom from the negative thought. All and all, you can choose to use this mantra if you like. Repeat them in your mind whenever the thought occurs during your meditation. But if you feel you cannot remember the mantra that I've been taught you now, you can choose your own mantra as well. It's just that, not required, but it just helps you to calm down your mind whenever the thought arises. So therefore, it is okay for you to choose your own mantra. For example, breathe in, breathe out. However you feel convenient for you, just make sure you focus yourself inside your body at the place called center of the body, and you shall be just fine. And now, as for our meditation, <coughs> just one moment. Ah, here we go. We are about to start our practice very soon. So those who are just joined recently and have not joined on time before I st uh, earlier, please don't forget to introduce yourself, your name, your local time, and the place where you watch this broadcasting from so I can get to know and remember you. Thank you very much, Andy. Hope you are doing well in your home and hope to see you again very soon. Now, let's see. Hello, Miss Daniel. Good to see you too. It seems that uh, Mr. Shi from Brunei has not uh, seen his busy with his recently deceased father who just passed away last week. So let's don't forget to, after our meditation, don't forget to sharing our loving kindness to his father and him and his family too. So thank you very much that I'm asked you today. Before we're going to start, let's see how much time we have left. Ah, we have about five minutes. So check yourself three things before you're going to start your meditation. One, do you need to call someone? If you do, do it now. Two, if you need to use toilet, finish it before you start meditation because you don't want that to disturb during your meditation, right? And last but not least, is your room available for meditation? If it is, then you are good to go. If it's not, you may want to Get your room be more clean and tidy, so that way it can make you feel pleasant and comfortable during meditation. The environment is also very essential. However, meditation that I'm about to practice with you now requires just two things that you need to practice together during your time. One, remember, you need to maintain relaxation. Make sure you are relaxed. If you are relaxed, you shall be just fine. If, if you are not, you are allowed to adjust yourself, making yourself be, be comfortable so that way you won't feel uneasy and you can feel relaxed through the rest of the meditation. When body relaxed, the mind can also result on that. And last but not least, if you relax too much, it's not good. Why? You could fall asleep. So therefore, during meditation, Maintain your mindfulness as well as your relaxed and comfortable feeling to the rest of your meditation. And if you follow this thing, you will be just fine. And so, if you are ready, let me give me some signal so that way I can get to know you. <coughs> All right. It seems we are ready to go then. We are about to start now. <coughs> Let's begin 
our meditation. Close your eyes. Relax your mind and body. Adjusting yourself, sitting in a relaxed and comfortable position. where you won't feel any tension on your body. Relax really truly. Begin from the top of your head. Relax down to your forehead. Loose your eyelids. Relax both of your eyebrows. Don't use your eyes during the meditation. Relax the muscles in your face, down to your neck and your shoulder. Adjusting your back and body properly, free from all the tension you might have. Relax both of your arms. All the way down to the tips of your hands. Continue further down to your legs, your knees, and all the way to your feet completely. Making your whole body feeling most comfortable during the meditation. Spend a few moments, adjust your body. When you are done, Let's move on to adjust your mind. Begin by take a deep breath. Slowly breathing it out. Take a deep breath a few more times. Slowly breathing it out. Clear your thoughts, empty your mind at the same time.
and imagine that yourself is alone in a place, a place that you like to be by yourself without anyone to disturb or bother you. A place of your own. Make you feel light, relaxed, and comfortable by just sitting there. A place like in the forest or on top of a mountain. When you are relaxed, light, and empty, allow the mind to come back to your body slowly and gently. Allow the mind slowly moving back into yourself like a feather floating down a feather floating down and softly touch inside yourself at the center around your abdomen Observe the mind through your feeling. Maintain your focus inside yourself by lightly imagine. Imagine the sun shine at the center. Observe the sun peacefully. Should the thought arise, don't worry. Let it go and let it in without following your thoughts. Or you may repeat the mantra in your mind at your own pace. And the mantra is Sama Arahang Sama Arahang Sama Maintain the focus while repeat the mantra in your mind at your own pace. Continue to observe the sun while relax both body and mind all together in this moment. Let's spend our time finding ourselves 
inner peace for a little while until the appropriate time.
Once your body and mind are balanced with one another, let the enjoyment and peacefulness fill your mind. You can open your mind to all beings and learn to love more openly, freely, beginning with loving kindness for yourself and then loving kindness for others you become more open relaxed and balanced radiating this loving kindness from the center out to everyone in the room, to your family and friends, to all the people in the home building, in the home country, and the whole world sharing loving kindness with them all a feeling for them to be happier the mind full of loving kindness will discover the way to work with others meaningfully, gently, happily, resolving whatever problems may arise, let there be peace on earth let there be world peace through inner peace. Spend our time sharing love and kindness in a few moments.
เอกดีปะSo much relaxed, and your mind so in, so much light that you feel like your body disappear. Leave only your awareness. Leave the comment as to. For those experience inner light in your meditation, even though you close your eyes, but you still see the light. Leave the comment as three. Anything else beyond what I mentioned, leave the comment as four. And now, whenever I read, I read your comment, I will get back to you as soon as I can. So let's take a look who has left the comment at this moment. Miss Janice, one. Miss Anne, one. Miss Diane, two. Kathy, one. Miss Kum, Mr. Kuma, two. Andy, two. Miss Patty, two. Warm soft breeze, very good. What? What about Mr. Daniel? Oh, he already left. Well, hope he is doing fine. And. Thank you very much for joining. Anyone else who like to leave the comment at the moment? It seems like Lekula are not uh, joining us today. Where is Miss April? Maybe she has been wandering somewhere. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for your time. Hello, Nina. One and two. Well, semi. That's good. What about your mama? Is she meditating with you? Well, hope she is doing well. It's not too early in your country, right? Well, it seems like everyone is doing fine, relax, and feeling like body disappear. Oh, well, that's good. But don't leave just yet. We have the wisdom to share, which is today, the echo. Okay, what is it about? How can we learn from that? Before we leave today, I like to leave that. Well, the thing is, in meditation, sometimes it's up, sometimes it's down. Sometimes is good, sometimes is bad. Don't take that into account, because every time we meditate, it is way new. So when it's always new, don't expect things. Just enjoy your relaxing, because you see, if you're working very hard each day, it is not good for the body if you don't rest. Right? Same thing with the mind. If you give a chance for your mind to rest through meditation. That is just like getting your body to rest too. So therefore, if you rest your body, don't forget to rest the mind. And that is how to practice by doing meditation would allow your mind to rest. So if it's new to you, well, you can start doing that every day now, giving yourself a chance to rest. Now, as for our wisdom that I like to share, the echo. What is it about? What can we learn, and how can we reflect this story into our daily life? Well, once upon a the time, there is this father and son 
who went into hiking in the mountain. And so one day, it is the first time that the son has been into the mountain. His son was still small, but was filled with, but his mind with, was filled with curiosity. One day, when he climbed up into the mountain, he just happened to fell down and he hurt himself. When he, mur- when he hurt himself, he cried out loud and he heard his own echo repeating the same thing. He asking father, his father, Dad, who is that? His father, knowing that it is the echo, so therefore he tried to teach him. So, well, son, let's talking back to that echo again. So the son asks, who is that? Then the echo coming back, who is that? Show yourself. The echo replied the same thing, show yourself. Then he said, uh, that's not nice, you should show yourself. The same thing repeating. And so his dad told him, son, introduce yourse- yourself to, the, to it. So the son said, hey, my name is this. And the echo repeat the same thing. Why did this, why did this person repeating after me? Well, the father said, you see, son, that is your echo. If you want to be nice, you say nice. So the son saying nice thing, the echo replied the same thing back to him. And that's the son learning that. Whatever that he say, it will come back to himself. Same thing with his life, our life, everyone. Whatever we do, it may reflect upon ourselves later on. Nothing has gone to waste. It's always come back in one way or another. Whether it's good or bad, it always reflect upon ourselves. So that's before we gonna think, speak or act. Always think very truly. Keep your mind under control. Then you will making yourself be more positive in your life. So that's in this concept. Someone had asked me about you see, I saw and read on your page. What is this thing called merit? Well, the merit itself, if you speaking in a kind of manner, is kind of like the fruit of your doing good deed. Whatever you do, it's come back to you. But this is in the positive manner. And so, if you want yourself to be, if you want your life to be filled with happiness, fill your life with merit. Do a lot of good things, and those things will come back to you. But remember, don't think that it's gonna give you the fruit right away. Everything takes time, just like when you plant flowers. There, when the times come, the flower will, will bloom. Or when you plant a fruit, when the fruit tree growing, it will give you, deliver you the fruit. So it takes time. Don't be too rushed. Give yourself time, okay? So, same thing with our meditation too. If you want to fill your life with peace and happiness, do a lot of good deeds, practice meditation every day. When the times come, it will deliver its fruit. So, make no mistake and live your life in peace and happiness. Thank you very much for watching Inner Peace Sunday today. I hope to see you again in next Sunday. And If you like this program, don't keep it to yourself. Don't forget to like and share or subscribe on our YouTube channel as well. And this video record will also be available in our YouTube channel later on. See you again. Thank you very much.